guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Long time no seen. <laughs> I hope you're good. I am doing pretty good. But what I wanted to talk about today is this vegan revolution in bodybuilding. What am I thinking of it? So, where do I get started? You know, like Hodge twins, right? Hodge twins now going vegetarian after seeing this video of um, pig slaughter. And um, I don't know, I can't help but not to notice that more and more people are waking up to uh, this fact. And um, okay, so what I think is basically, you know what, I don't agree with people who say people meant to eat meat, people meant to eat just vegetables, people meant to eat this or that. No, I think people uh, survived all these years because of the way we adapt we can thrive on um uh, sources of our nutrition from well basically different sources so i'm not saying that eating meat is all wrong so you know how we um you know we use food as a fuel but also we celebrate eating food sharing it with friends family and now um i think that eating is very intimate and um now i think a lot of people are very disconnected with what we eat so um you know i think about it like that like i didn't think about it before but like i could not get myself to kill an animal i could not so how could i possibly have a right to pay someone else to do it for me and you see i was trying to believe that like animals are killed in like a human way uh that it's all okay but you see these are slaughterhouses these are not euthanasia centers these people uh, these, these animals are killed in a very violent way and you know try to look maybe at some of these videos but basically these animals are suffering they're scared you can tell you can tell that these animals are you know really really scared you know uh back in the day i used to be vegetarian for about three years for all different reasons um but you know what i was doing okay on a vegetarian diet i switched to meat eating diet when i got into bodybuilding I, you know, it was difficult for me, but I kind of um, thought, you know, I need protein, you know, and all that, and I need to eat meat. Now, um, you know, in a, now I go a bit into envir environmental uh, reasons. You see, in 1812, there was half billion people on Earth, right? Then the world population by 100 years later was already 1 billion. Then another 100 years, 2012, 7 billion so we are multiplying so quickly right and now how are you gonna keep up with the demand of meat for so many people you know i believe that uh you know slaughterhouses will be worse and worse because um because of the demand growing like there is no way to make it in a nice nice humane way and um you know like up to 51% of uh, world population is because of the animal agriculture, you know? So, so I personally decided to just go with it. At first, I was um, nervous and scared. I was, you know, um, scared where am I going to get my protein from. But I'm getting uh, more and more comfortable with it and actually quite excited. You see, I have a good um, knowledge of nutrition. So I believe that with time, I'm going to be able to get my diet on point. It's going to be good, you know. And um, yeah, it is easier to get your protein from meat. But then another thing is like, think about it. Um, Protein in our body is broken down for amino acids. You see, in a, like a plant-based diet, you have only amino acids, 
but it's hard to build a complete block of protein. But what difference it makes? We are going to break down the protein into amino acids. So we can have this amino acid from straight to the point from the vegetables and then, you know, use them accordingly. Another thing is when you combine like uh, beans, chickpeas, whatever with rice, you're getting complete protein anyway. So you know what, I don't think it's going to be like, such an issue. And you know what, I'm not going to do it overnight. I already cut out meat. I don't want to eat it. And it was really easy. And not only easy, but like just within a few days, I, I start to feel like, man, I cannot even think of eating it again. But, um, you know, there are some uh, stuff like, I don't know, dairy, uh, it's going to be a bit harder for me. I will give it up eventually, but um, I'll still be taking my whey protein at this moment. And as I said, at the moment, I'm too, um, I'm too rigid, like I'm not sure how to get all the nutrition that I need from vegan vegetarian diet but i will do my best do my research and i know that i will get there and if you want to join me let's go together <laughs> and if you're not um uh, well please don't judge me i'm not judging anyone who's eating meat either but just maybe be more aware of where your food is coming from if it's so intimate if it's if it's um you know, such a big part of a life. Just take a look where is it coming from, how it's ending up in these packages, sterilized, you know, in the supermarket. Um, yeah, that's what I wanted to talk about today. I think I covered most of what I wanted to say. So basically for environmental and ethical reasons, I want to give up meat and animal products. So, yeah. And guys, please, if you like this video, give me some thumbs up. Uh, like this video, comment, and um, subscribe to my channel. And follow all my social medias, which I'm going to link down below. And I hope to see you guys soon. Bye!